Living in tumultuous political times when the left and the right are sharply divided. WRL is committed to the truth and the facts. So starting today, we're partnering with PolitiFacts to analyze, research, and report to you the facts behind the claims and the verified information behind all the noise. PolitiFact was created more than 10 years ago when then reporter Bill Adair, now head of the journalism program at Duke, reported what a politician said even though it was clearly an exaggeration of the truth. And I didn't fact check it, and no one from my newspaper fact checked it, and I felt guilty about that, and that moment kind of hung with me, and that's ultimately what led to PolitiFact. His idea was to research the claims politicians or pundits made, to talk to them and research the sources behind their statements, and we'll rate the statement on the truth meter from true to mostly true to false or worse, pants on fire, a designation meaning a claim is so false, it's ridiculous. In recent years, it's become more acceptable to use deception as uh, a political strategy. Um, maybe it was always that way, but uh, it seems more obvious now. WRAL PolitiFact reporter Paul Spey has been covering local, state, and national politics for years. You know, people almost expect politicians to lie to them or to exaggerate, uh, but what they don't expect is outright falsehoods, and that's where PolitiFact comes in. The process doesn't happen in a vacuum with just one person deciding on the rating. One thing I love about PolitiFact is that the format is very structured, and it's, it's not up to me to decide what is or isn't true. It's up to me to go do the research. And then it's up to uh, the research to tell us what is true. After the reporter says where he thinks it lands on the truth of meter he presents his research to a board of three trained editors who make the final call based on the evidence they have. It's all in an effort to bring you the best and most researched report possible. It's about giving people important information in a democracy so they can make smarter decisions.